Hello, and welcome to this tutorial which will demonstrate how to edit existing interiors in Grand Theft Auto and how to export the edited interiors into 5M. We will be using the Mission Road Police Department as an example and will be making new additions to the Police Department. Before beginning, the only tool that will be required is Codewalker. You will need version 2.9 or higher in order to export the interiors. I've linked the latest version of Codewalker in the description of this video. Now, let's begin by opening up Codewalker. Once everything is loaded, make your way over to the police department by holding the left mouse button and using WASD. Once you've made your way over there, go over to the menu on the right hand side and select MP Christmas 2017 under the drop down menu and then check Enable DLC. Once it is finished loading, we can go into the interior and make sure everything is loaded as intended. Now go to the selection tab and click mouse select. Now press the T key, which will bring up the toolbar and right click on a prop inside the interior you're trying to edit. Select the project overview button on the toolbar and then under the YTYP menu, select add to project. Now that the Y2YP has been added to the project, we can start deleting props. We're going to start off with these chairs and then we're going to adjust these seats as to give more room into the lobby. Now that we've gone over the basics of editing and removing prompts, now let's start adding props. Make sure you have a prop selected in the room that you would like to add a prop to. Go back and open up the project overview and under the YTYP menu, select MLO and then add entity. Set the model of this entity to the model name of your choice. Now you can move it around and set it to where you would like it to be. Once we've finished editing the interior, let's save this interior by selecting File, and then save YTYP as, and then let's name it after the interior name so it can override the existing interior in 5M. You can also save the CoWalker product as a file just in case you need to edit it in the future. Now that we have the file saved, let's open up our 5M resources folder and create a new folder called Map Add-ons. Let's go into that folder and create a new file called underscore underscore resource dot Lua, and then edit the file. Type in what I'm currently typing and then save the file. Create a new folder called stream and enter it. Now open up where you saved your YTYP file and copy paste it into the stream folder. Now head over to the folder which has your server config and edit your config. Add start map add-ons to your server config and then save. Now run the 5M server and connect to your server. Once you load in, head over to the police department and you can see your changes loaded in. The current changes I made are a little more detailed than just the lobby being changed. I also changed the briefing room to an office, changed the nameplate, and added the ability to sit in the seats in both the captain's office and the normal office. The changes I made today are going to be available to my patrons, which they will be able to download this Codewalker project to experiment for themselves. Patreon is the main way to support my channel and mods these days, so if you like what I do, consider becoming a patron. And be sure to subscribe to my channel for future content. If you have any questions, you can leave a comment below or head over to our Discord where we have an awesome community of people willing to help out. Thanks for watching my video, and I'll see you next time.